How's it going everyone? Welcome to another video on the Foxtag YouTube channel. This time we talk about, as you can see, we have the iPhone and the topic is how do you increase the ringtone volume on iPhone? Now, ringtone is basically the sound whenever you somebody somebody's calling you so you would expect perhaps to find it inside of the phone section inside of the settings but it's not there you have to go to the sounds and haptics which is right here and there is a slider for ringtone and alert so literally in to increase ringtone you have to slide it up like this to make sure that you get the desired result and if you slide it up actually you will hear the sample of what it's going to sound like. So you have like a real life test to see how loud it actually is going to get when somebody is going to call you. So that's something to pay attention to. And as I also mentioned in one of my videos, you need to make sure that change with buttons is set properly for you. I can't say if it's good to have it turned on or not, but in case you have this toggle switched on, and if you come back to the home screen and use the buttons on the side of the iPhone, the volume buttons, the rockers up and down, in this case, when you use them with the option switched on, you can adjust the ringtone volume right from the home screen using the buttons. So in case you change it a lot, change it often, make sure that you have it set up this way so you can always change it up with the buttons. I personally don't keep it turned on because I like to change the volume of the content or of the things which I actually watch on my on my device. So that's why I don't really like to have it turn on. And of course, this is basically all the stuff that you need to know about it. In case your iPhone has some problems with the volume of your ringtones, perhaps something is faulty inside of the speaker. So try test out the speaker with music, try to play some content, make sure that you play something really loud on your phone to hear if the problem is physically in the speaker or if some settings just prevent your iPhone going to the full volume that you want. So I'm going to wrap up this video right now. Hope you found it useful. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe down below so you never miss future videos like this one. And I will see you in the next tutorial in the future.